Hey, you know, Catra, I'm not questioning your leadership here, but maybe we shouldn't pick on the heavily armed crowd. Oh, yeah? And what are they going to do? Send me to die in the Crimson Ways? <gasps> Would you look at that? I'm already here. Good riddance to that She-Ra girl. Are you kidding me? If I ever see that boy or his sparkly friend or that angry blonde one again, I swear <gasps> I'll... Which way did they go? Who are you? You said there was a sparkly girl, a boy with arrows, and a blonde. Which way did they go? Buzz off, kitty kitty. What, are you too dumb to understand a simple question? Just point, genius, and I'll figure it out. <clears throat> hey, uh... Catra? What? Last thing I remember, Hordak sent us out here to track down First One's tech, not Adora. So why do we need to know which way they're going? Because Adora and her friends are always after the same thing we are. Of course they're in the literal middle of nowhere. Yeah, the nerve. So spit it out already. Where are they going? There are only two rules in the Crimson Waste. One, the strong make the rules. <laughs> So, oh, here's the thing. I've done this. The whole threatening people bit, the intimidation. I've been there, and I just don't care anymore. Some people have a bad day. I've had a bad life. If I want something, it's taken from me. If I win a fight, I lose the war. Threats only work on someone who has something to lose. But me? I've already lost it all. And you can't be any good at this because you just let yourself get distracted.